Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here or just stopping by, hello. My name is Jennifer. I'd love it if you stuck around and subscribed. If you do, you know, thank you. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. Today, I wanted to go dark, so we went very dark. Um, yeah, this video will be up. It, I, it should already be up, but if not, then it will be the next video that goes up on my channel. Anywho, happy quarantining. I hope you guys are having fun and staying safe. And you already know from the title of this video that today I want to I wanna throw things in the floor. Ho, ho, ho. I want to declutter all of my lip stuff. So, this is going to be fun. The first thing we need to go over in this video is that... I'm not throwing things in the floor. I have a basket right here that I am going to, when I get done filming this, I'm going to put the palettes that have not been um, retrieved. I don't know. I'm, I'm making that basket like uh, when my friends come over after quarantine, they can go through it. And if they find something they think they might like, they can have it. It's like um, an in-person giveaway basket, I guess. And then my empties trash can thingy is right there. So... Let's get into it. Oh, I don't, I started having these in order with, this was supposed to be like my most used stuff and one bin was supposed to be um, like second used stuff and then there I have a back bin that's supposed to be things I don't really reach for that often but still want to keep in my collection and well, um, it's gone to hell in a handbasket so there's no organization here. We're just gonna we're just gonna wing it, okay? It's gonna be fun. I have a lot of these in my collection, and these are from Wet n Wild. They're the liquid cat suit, the matte versions. I freaking love these. These are probably one of my favorite formulas, and it's even better that it's Wet n Wild, so it's super affordable and at the drugstore. This is caramel cake. This is from a collection. I don't know what collection. It has roses on the top. This is what I'm wearing right now, and it's called Dark Desire, and I'm loving it. So there's more of them in here. Like I said, here's one of the high shine ones. This is in Devil's Advocate. I freaking love it. Once again, we're on a trend. I like dark, 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 or nude for the most part, and reds. There's lots of reds in here. Here is, these are pretty much my two lip glosses I bounce in between. This is Buxom's White Russian. If you've watched my videos before, I use this a lot and this is pretty much a spot on dupe for it. This is the Milani Keep It Full Lip Plumper and this is an Almost Natural. I want to get more of these. I want to get more of these. We're struggling here. So, so far I've not gotten rid of anything and I feel really bad about it. Okay. <laughs> um, these, I do think I have a few. Two at least. These are the, oh, these are different. How are they different? I don't think they are. Whatever. These are from L'Oreal. They're the Infallible Paints. This one says matte and this one doesn't, but they're both matte liquid lipsticks. Anywho, this is in Tongue Tied. I bought this on Taylor Wynn's recommendation and this is pretty gunky and dried out and I will need to repurchase this, but I'm pretty sure this is long expired. So this is going into my empties bin. I wish it wasn't. Y'all, candles just fell out of my damn empties thing and I thought they busted. This is in Spicy Blush. This one, from what I understand, yeah, this one's still good and rolling. This is a pinky nude. We're going to keep that. I went from no Jeffree Star products at all to several there's more in here there has to be more in here isn't there? we'll find them as they come out but yeah there's I don't know how I got so many in such a short period but these are I believe all of my ooh, sorry these are all of the liquid lipsticks I have thus far and some of them, most of them are limited edition. Um, I bought all of the Shane Dawson ones. So I have, are you filming? Ryland, oh my God, 
Shane, and then this is Jeffrey. What the fuck? So a hot pink. I kind of want to get rid of Shane. I, if you go back and watch the conspiracy collection video I filmed, this is the lip I wanted to go with because it's so out of my comfort zone. Um, I think it might work better for me as a lip topper, so I'm going to keep it for now. But if I can't find a way to get it working where it's not patchy and every time I layer it to try to get it not patchy, it just continually wipes off what's underneath it. I might, I'm probably going to get rid of it. Um, are you filming? Is this really pretty orangey red? Going to keep that. Go. Oh my God. Why do I keep thinking that says, oh my God, or go, but it's, oh my God, this is a really pretty blue tone, baby pink. It is super, super pretty. Keeping that, I'll be keeping most of my Jeffree Star. Actually, now that I'm looking down at it, I'm going to keep all my Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks because they're not that old. I know they're not expired. This is Rylan. It's pretty much just a pretty shimmery pink. Um, Poinsettia, I believe, was a... One of these was... No. Whatever. I have Poinsettia, which is a really pretty red with gold reflect in it. Diva is, I think this was a limited edition one or a collection one or some shit because it's really pretty. It's a hot pink, but it's, I don't know. These two are different, okay? I'm not, I'm not an expert on the colors, but I can tell that these two are different. So keeping that, this was the Summer Mystery Box Mystery Shade. It's just called Question Mark. This is such a pretty pink like rosy pink nude shade and then my all-time favorite I'm ashamed at how much I use this this is mannequin when I run out of it I will be repurchasing it um I really love his formula all except for Shane which acted weird when I used it but I love mannequin so keeping it there are several other shades from Jeffree Star that I would love to add to my collection so expect this to continue to grow and get out of control and I Wish I could say I'm sorry, but I'm not. So moving on, I have lost it. No, I didn't. Okay, I have two of the NYX push-up, what are these even called? Lingerie push-ups. Um, oh my God. Oh, I got it. We're good. Um, this is in the shade Embellishment. This is such a pretty purpley mauve dark shade. It doesn't look dark when you first apply it, but it really truly does end up dark on me at least. I freaking love this. I went through a phase where I was wearing this every day for like three weeks. And then this shade is exotic. This is so pretty. It doesn't look, it comes out a lot more red tone than what it looks in the tube. I really love these. They're very minty. I freaking love it. But if you are sensitive to scent, these are very, very minty. Um, let's find something I'm going to get rid of. Can we do that? Okay, here we go. This is the OG NYX Lingerie Liquid Lipstick. I got mine in lace detail. One, this is 18 months and I bought this when it launched. So it's very dry. Ooh, sorry, my thing just cut out. Anywho, this is, it looks dry and chunky. There's like actual chunks on it. So I'm going to be getting rid of this. It is a pretty color, but I do not appreciate the formula of this also hang on let me fix the light there we go we shouldn't have any other light problems I am not afraid to pin things back my hair is doing some weird shit today you know what you know what I'm not afraid <sighs> I'm looking adorable hang on let me try to get this a little a little better hidden situated maybe something god bless that looks terrible moving on so i'm getting rid of that for sure let's see this is by ofra this is a long lasting liquid lipstick this is, is from ipsy unzipped and um i don't see a shade on it but i haven't gotten ipsy in about four years so i know this is expired and i never really used it getting rid of it you guys <laughs> I need to repurchase these, um, but I know they're expired. I'm getting rid of them. These are the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color. This one is just the lip color. This is the Matte Liquid Matte Lip Mousse. This is in the shade Crimson, Crim, Crimson Sky. This is so pretty. It's such a good purpley red, but that mousse 
situation is not for J Boogie. I'm not a fan of this. Getting rid of it. And this is in the shade Seduction. And I know for a fact this is expired. It is such a pretty shade. Look at how much I use it. It's just all over the container. I freaking loved it though. So I will, I do want to repurchase it very much. I don't know if I will. I need to get my shit under control here. Here's another two of the Wet n Wild liquid cat suits. This is in Give Me Mocha, such a pretty shade. This is in Nudist Peach. Can you tell a trend with my lips here? We like nudes, okay? Here's another one. This is in Rebel Rose. This is like a pinky nude. They're all different, swear my life. You can tell they're different, right? They're similar. But they're all different, so I do love them. We have a little MAC Mini Bullet Lipstick. This is in Velvet Teddy. Um, I did use this a little bit, but I'm just not a big fan of this. This is the only MAC product I own as of now, and I'm just not a big fan. And everyone used to go batshit over MAC lipstick, so getting rid of it. Uh, I know I have another one of these. We're right here. Okay, these are from Rimmel. These are the Stay... They're different. Never mind. Okay, this is the Stay Satin from Rimmel. And this is in the shade Reticle. This is such a pretty red shade. I bought this when we moved into this house. So I know it's not expired. Is that I know of? Oh my god. 24 months. Not expired yet. Okay. This is such a pretty shade. Like I said, there's going to be several reds in here. So we're just going to work with it. I'm keeping it. This is the same situation, but this is Stay Matte. And this is in the shade Pitch Black. And can we just discuss that the lipstick I have on right now is not even meant to be a black and it's more black? Because can we talk about what that is? What is that? That's like a sheer gray color so getting rid of it i don't know if there's gonna be any in my friend box this is another wet and wild and so nor cool it's just the black um i know i have more of these too i just don't know where they are because these are all not organized um it's, this is from nyx it's the liquid suede and this is in the shade cherry skies once again, I went through a real big phase where I literally only wore red lips and winged eyeliner. It was a phase, it was a thing, it was a look, okay? And I appreciated it. And hell, I might go back to it at this point, okay? So I'm keeping it because I loved it. Um, Are these the only ones I have from Anastasia? No, I think I have another one in here. These are Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipsticks. This is in Dusty Rose. I'm actually going to put that in my friend basket. And this is in the shade Allison. I freaking love this shade. It's such a pretty shade. But Dusty Rose was not my business. Um, This is a Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid in the shade Nude Flush. This was okay, but once again, I've used it to death. And it's older than the dirt. There's no way it's not expired, so. NYX Butter Gloss, this is in Creme Brulee. These are awesome, cheap, fun, and they work, so I'm keeping it. Um, I have a Dose of Colors Liquid Lipstick. This is in Truffle. Uh, it doesn't look bad, but it smells funky, so we're gonna get rid of it. I can remember buying this like five years ago, so. Oh, I have another Rimmel Stay Satin, and this one is in the shade Have a Cow. This looks really pretty but it's I don't know it's just not a shade I think I would well you know what I think I'd wear this over the bright red I'm gonna get rid of the bright red which was reticle put it in my friend basket this is a L'Oreal infallible pro matte gloss in oh it's on the top nude elude this does not seem very nudie to me it's more of a red pinky situation um I do like the applicator for this the applicators on these are really cool, but I don't think I'd wear this very often anymore, so it's going in my friend basket. I have a ColourPop, what is this, Ultra Satin Lip in Calypso, and this is a really pretty shade. I mean, I can only say it's a really pretty shade a few times because, I mean, I do have shades that are very similar to it, um, and if I remember right, I don't like this formula very much. But I know it's not expired, so friend basket it goes. 
I'm feeling better. The gears are starting to turn. We have a MAC lip gloss, a little baby one, and this is in see-through. And um, it's been through some things. This is a very goopy, thick, sticky, nasty mess. So I'm getting rid of it. Into the empties we go. We have a Koki Kissable Liquid Lipstick in the shade Mad About Mauve. I love this shade. I really, really do. It's, I don't know, it's like, it's like all my other liquid lipsticks. Okay, into the friend pile. We have an Ulta Beauty lip crayon in the shade Festival. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in the friends pile if they want it. We have a Clinique lipstick in Plum Pop. Oh, that's a pretty shade. Okay, okay, cute packaging too. The only problem is I can remember buying this several, several years ago. So I know that's expired. And we have a Maybelline, what are these even called? Color Sensationals. And this is in the shade gray over it. Um, after I got done with my funky ass red winged liner phase, I went into a, I wanted a gray lipstick. Um, I do really like this shade. The only thing is I can see some Jaclyn Hill bubbles in there and like, it don't look right, so it's probably expired. Empties. <sighs> We're one basket down, guys. I'm feeling pretty confident. I'm feeling good. Um, I have one lip, lip scrub. This is from Jeffree Star. I think I got this in the summer one. Oh, it's right underneath the lower lip scrub. This is strawberry gum. I don't use this a whole ton, but I do like having it in my collection. For the most part, when I brush my teeth every day, I just go over my lips and it pretty much does this, but this smells intoxicating, so I'm gonna have to keep it. I have to, okay? Don't come for me. I have definitely kept more than I've gotten rid of, but I'm feeling confident that this will end up better. This is from LA Girl. It's a glazed lip paint in the shade Blushing. I bought this at Forever 21 um, my senior year of high school, which was 2012 to 2013. So <laughs> into the empties. I know that bad boy is expired. Um, I have a Jeffree Star lip liner in the shade Allegedly. Um, I don't really use lip liners a whole ton, but I've clearly been using this one. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna go with it, okay. Um, I have another one of the L'Oreal Matte Infallible Paints. This is in the shade Cinnabomb. Can we, can we see my predicament here, okay? I like the same colors from pretty much everyone, okay? And I'm sorry, kinda. Um, this is a color sensational in the shade Rich Ruby. Um, I do really, really like this shade. I love these lipsticks, but the amount of times I reach for a bullet lipstick over a liquid lipstick is almost never. So I'm going to get rid of that into the friend pile. Okay. So I'm pretty sure this was the Halloween collection. I know it's not expired because I got it for a Halloween video this past year. This is in purple panic from wet and wild. It is going to go into my friend pile. The likelihood of one of my friends actually getting that out of there and be like, you know what? Fuck it. I want bright purple lips. It's slim to none, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put it in there just in case somebody's feeling frisky one day, okay? I need to get rid of this. I know it's expired. Do not judge me. I'm gonna tell you why I'm gonna keep it. This is from Covergirl with Katy Perry, and this is in the shade Sphinx. Um, has anyone ever actually finished a full lipstick? I haven't, but look how freaking close I am. And I pretty much put this on every morning I go to work. It's just the perfect your lip color, but better. And it looks, it looks old, okay? It's been through some things. I know it's expired. I know, but I'm gonna keep it because I want to finish it and then it'll go in the empties, okay? Okay? Don't yell at me. We have a Clinique Chubby Stick Intense Moisturizing Lip Color Balm, and this is in the shade Roomiest Rose. And something went crazy here. It is very pretty though, but um, I think it melted is probably what happened, but it I do like these. I remember why I bought this. I, just, I do like it, but it is clearly seen better days. So empties. 
We have an Ulta Beauty Pat and Shine Liquid Lipstick in the shade Verona. I am going to keep this because I remember getting it right before I moved into this house and it's just such a pretty color. Okay. Such a pretty color. This is from Urban Decay. This is a Vice Liquid Lipstick in the shade Back Talk. I have to keep this because it's such a pretty shade. Yes, they all look very similar, but they are different. I know they're different. You don't have to understand. You're not here, you're not my dad, okay? I'm keeping them. I have a Maybelline, what are these even called? Super Stay Matte Ink. And this is in the shade Ruler. And I think I've used this once. I remember buying this when it, like, well not when it first came out, but I can remember buying this in the past year or so. And I remember I bought it because Taylor Wynn was talking about it. Cause if my girl Taylor recommends it, I'm probably going to end up buying it at some point. And if I remember correctly, this is the shade she was talking about. I don't remember using it. I've probably only used it once. So I'm going to keep it for now. We have a L'Oreal lipstick, bullet lipstick, colorish, colorish lipstick this is in zoe's red it's a collection exclusive and i can tell you right now i've had this since like 2014 it is expired it is leaving the building hello we have another nyx liquid suede and this one is in the shade kitten hills and i can remember buying this like six years ago i know it's expired there's no way it's not and also i don't really ever go for bright reds much anymore i and if I do, I have the, what is this even called? Are you filming from Jeffree Star? So I don't feel the need to keep another bright red. It's going in the empties only because it's expired. We have um, a few of these Anastasia mini bullet lipsticks. We have the shade Cotton Candy. I've never used that. I'm not going to use that. Into the Friends pile, we have the shade Orchid. I think I bought this in a set. I've never used that one either. Oh, this is not going good. Well, I mean, it is for my friends. This is the shade Stargazer. That's a super hot pink. That's looking pretty sim. Seri sim, sim this is looking pretty similar to Jeffrey What the Fuck. So, definitely getting rid of that one. And then this is Plumeria. Ooh, that's pretty, but the likelihood of me actually wearing that in a bullet lipstick is slim to none. Going to the friends. Um, this is an e.l.f. matte lip color in the shade Wine. Um, something weird has happened there too. I know this is, 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 is expired. Somehow it just got on my hand. It's going into the empties. Wow. I have three. Is this all I got right now? These are the NYX Soft Matte Lip Creams. Do you guys remember when these like exploded? Everyone was recommending these and I'm getting rid of all of them. This is Addis Ababa. 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 It's going. <laughs> um, this is in Tokyo. I don't really wear these super super pale shades anymore and this is in Transylvania and though I love the color I don't wear these very often so in the thingy to the friends it goes this is another dose of colors liquid lipstick I don't know what color it is because the sticker is gone but it's going to my friends I don't really like dose of colors that much this is another liquid suede from NYX, and this one is in Alien. It's a black. I'm going to keep it. I want to buy Jeffree Star's black, but until I get there, I'm going to keep this one. And my, these are the only two blacks I have, Wet n Wild NYX, and I'm going to keep them because you never know when you need a black lipstick, okay? And though this looks black, it's not, okay? Moving on. I have another Revlon matte lip color, and this one is in the shade Passion, and I can remember using this in 2015, even though it does not look bad. You know what? Let me sniff it. Let me sniff it. No, that smells rough. Around my nose ring is super dry. I have a lot of the Rimmel Exaggerate lip liners, right? I started buying these because of Nicole Guerrero in the shade Snob. I just found another one. I must have used all of Snob and gotten rid of it, but that 
is it called snob or snooty or something I can't remember what it is but if I saw it in the store I'd remember exactly what it was called um she used the shit out of it she said it was like her favorite pinky nude and I used to be obsessed with Nicole Guerrero so therefore I bought that and then I liked these so I bought a, several um we have obsession we have ravish we have peachy beachy and we have cherry kiss and I'm gonna get rid of all four of these because I don't use lip liners that much I'm feeling good I found another Shane Dawson this is I gotta go this is like a bronze lip color. I've never gotten to use it. I'm keeping it. I just found a bright red hair. Do you know how long it's been since I've had bright red hair? Months. Okay. That's disgusting. Um, two more lip liners. This is by NYX. Retractable lip liner in red. Uh, I'm going to keep that only because most of the time I'm not going to keep that. That looks... Into the empties. And this is from NYX, and this is in the shade Pinky Rose. Um, once again, I don't really use those colors very much. To the friends we go. Elf Moisturizing Lipstick in the shade Blackberry. And this is cool because there's like a little mini gloss in there. I saw a thing on TikTok saying that this was a sample of the lipstick. It is not. It's meant to be like a lip gloss to layer over it. Oh my god. What even? What? Okay, well, I think it's pretty important to note that that's going in the empties. Um, I have an Ulta Beauty Matte Lip Crayon in Soiree. I'm going to keep it. Maybelline Lash... Lash. <laughs> I'm so used to my mascara. Maybelline Color Sensational in the shade Touch of Spice. Oh, it looks like I've used a little bit of this one. I'm gonna get rid of it because there's some weird balling a foot in there. Clinique Long Last Lipstick in Power with Pink. I don't think I, I, I used it because I can see at the top, but I don't think I'd ever wear that again. Friends, Anastasia Liquid Lipstick, Pure Hollywood. This is the first one I ever bought. I lusted after it. Okay, let me tell you. Um, uh, but do I really use it? Not a lot since I got mannequin here. These are actually pretty similar. It looks a little bit there. This one's a little more brown, but anywho, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. Another NYX soft matte lip cream. This one is in Monte Carlo. Okay, do we see a trend with the colors? I'm going to get rid of this one because I know I used the hell out of it. So here we go. Um, yet another Dose of Colors Liquid Lipstick. And yet another one without a sticker, which means it's older than the dirt. Um, I believe this is the shade Stone, maybe. I don't know. Friends. Uh, girl, I have two more Wet n Wild. Um, this is in Video Vixen. This is such a pretty brown red shade. And this is in Hexcellent, which is a really pretty deep red. Keeping Elf Liquid Lipstick. And this is in Red Vixen. Y'all know, if you watch my channel, this is the red I go to over and over and over and over and over again. So I'm going to keep it. And you know what? Because I'm going to keep it, I'm going to get rid of the Liquid Suede in Cherry Skies. To the friends, another lip liner from NYX. This one is in Plum. It looks rough. Gonna get rid of it. We have a Jordana Sweet Cream Matte Liquid Lip Color. That's just cute. This is in Red Velvet Cake. It's very pretty. It's a darker red, um, a darker blue red, like I said. I think I've only used this once. I'm gonna keep it just to see how I feel about it. This... <laughs> Can we talk about this? Okay, this is like six years old and this is a different lipstick from Clinique. That's what it's called, different lipstick. And this is in the shade Different Grape. And it doesn't look like I used a lot of it, but this is what got me to start using more purpley, darker purpley shades. And this was like, this was like my life, okay? And though I don't want to, I'm going to get rid of it because I have shades very similar to that in my collection now. And I know that bad boy is 
super expired, but I can remember going to my Clinique counter at my Peebles right out of high school and getting that, so. We have another e.l.f. matte liquid lipstick. This one's in, this one is in the shade T Rose. This is such a pretty pale pinky nude because we know that I love pale pinky nudes. I've got to keep it. I lied to you. This is Dose of Color Stones. I did not realize I had so many Dose of Color. Nonetheless, this is a really cool purpley mauvey kind of weird. It's the, a weird pinky purpley shade. I'm going to get rid of it and give it to a friend. We have the Revlon Color Burst. Balm stain, I think is what that says, in a door. Um, I, I'm gonna get rid of this. It looks funky as hell, but I do like it, but it looks nasty. And then lastly, I have another color sensational lipstick, and this is in Gone Grage. Oh, it's so pretty. Yes, okay, so. I'm feeling pretty confident. We're done. We're out. We're out of bins to declutter. Oh, I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. Okay, so we're out of bins officially to declutter. I'm feeling really good about this. Um, let me hop off of the screen very quickly and reorganize this in some fashion, hopefully, and I'll come back and kind of give you a run through of how I have it set up. Okay, so that didn't take me very long. Um, I decided since I got rid of quite a bit, I didn't feel like I got rid of a lot, but I have another bin that's completely empty and this one's not completely filled and this one has some room to grow too. Okay, so how I'm gonna have this set up is the same way which in my drawers, which are Alex from Ikea drawer knockoffs that I found on Amazon. Um, I have, I'm stupid. I have these two in the drawer like back to back like this and then there's enough room to have this one running along the side of them that's how i'm gonna keep it i'm gonna just put the empty one in the back of the drawer and this is where i'm gonna keep my most used um lip products which both of the nyx lip embellishment or lip push-up lip whatever lingerie push-ups are gonna be in there um mannequin buxom's white russian I'm keeping one red, but the rest of these are all pinky nudes. Just all of my favorite pinky nudes. So I'm happy with that. All three of the glosses I own are in here. And then this one has all my other Jeffree Star and Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suits, which are obviously my two favorite formulas. They're all in here with like the one bullet lipstick I kept. The one lip liner I kept and my lip scrub are in this little container. And I'm really happy with how much... I decluttered. Um, you'll notice there weren't any moisturizers in here because I only keep three. I have one of the Vaseline Rosy Lip Tube lipstick or chapsticks that I keep in my pocket at work. I have one of the chapstick total hydration, like I don't know, serum situations. This is a vi oh, vitamin enriched lip night serum. This is very thick, very goopy. And I don't use it very often, but sometimes after skincare, when I come in here to uh, dermaplane my face and like my lash serum and all of that, I will put this on. And then for day to day, most of the time when I get ready, I just smack on some Vaseline. Um, I bought this in October and I'm like halfway through it. I'm pretty impressed with myself. Those are the things I use to moisturize my lips. But that is it for this video, guys. I hope you had fun decluttering with me. Um... <laughs> I'm running out of makeup to declutter. I've already done my palettes, my foundations. I really need to do my powders, but I don't know if I'll make a video out of that. Happy quarantining. I hope you guys are staying safe. And um, if you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel and give it a like down below. Um, yeah, and that's all I have to say in this video. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye, guys.